Well, Michael, I see you're back around and making time for your mental health. Yeah, I don't know why I came. Hmm. What do you want, Michael? I don't know. Just... I just want... I want something that isn't this. You know? This caring about two things at once. I mean, I want to be a good dad. Love my family. You know, live the dream. But at the same time... I really want the other stuff, too. I suppose you haven't really considered the fact that by neglecting your therapy, you've guaranteed these behavioral relapses. No, I hadn't considered that. So, pal, what's the source of conflict this time? Things are kind of on the uptick, Doc. There's no greater concern than optimism. Where are we now? Ah, <laughs> uh, today's getting hard to keep track of who wants to kill me at any given moment. <laughs> Trevor still wants to eat my liver, but we're playing nice because we're working a job together. The FIB, they want me dead uh, because I'm no longer useful to them. The investor guy who hooked me up with the studio, he's pissed off because I didn't burn it down for him. But the wife and kids are back under the roof. So maybe things are OK. Mm-hmm. Well, family is important, Michael. But make sure you want them there for the right reasons. Any other acting out friend? Tell me. Yeah, I mean, I've had good days, Doc, but mostly they've just been really bad days. I've been doing really bad things, you know. Hurting people. You're a very sick man, Michael. I'm doing all I can, but we need more sessions. I want to be good, Doc. I really do. But then I get angry. Hmm. Anything else? Anything sexual? Look, I made a few mistakes, Doc. Pretty bad ones, but. The last few days, it's been a lot better. Well, I suppose you seeing the problems you cause is progress of a sort. So I feel like there's progress in some areas and, you know, none in others. That's incredible stuff. I don't think I've ever heard such a barrage of denial, self-justification, and outright horror. The thing is, Michael, here, can we just get a quick photo together? Cheese. What is this? I really think I can't treat you anymore. The fact is, I'm in love with you. The fuck you talking okay, about, Okay, well, Doc? that's not true. <laughs> Good, you're learning. Good. What's going on? Nothing, it's just, I think you need a new therapist. And I'm leaving town. I've got a TV show. I'm gonna be famous. I'm gonna be famous. <laughs> think of the fucking tail. All those fucking bitches who called me pube head. <laughs> oh, they'll be lining up to suck it now. You got a TV show. You! Uh, best not to think too closely about what I just said. It's not like I'll be using real names or anything. <laughs> I'm really discreet. <laughs> Bye now. Fuck. Isn't this the attention you were looking for?
saved it. Good. I saved you again, Davey. Again. So what are you going to do for me about Haynes, the rest of the FIB, the IAA, and everyone else, huh? History's written by the living, okay? We can pin most of it on Agent Sanchez. I get that story right, and the agency and bureau will back off. The problem we need to deal with is Trevor. Trevor? Why? Try Merriweather, Chinese gangsters, general insanity, and so on. I can spin Steve that you're controllable, but not Trevor. Steve? He's our wounded hero right now. I gotta cozy up to him, calm him down. Just get me out. from Life Invader. Bro, I know you'll find this hard to believe, but it's kind of difficult for someone with a middling GPA and bad references to get a job in this climate. You gotta help me. Hey, if there's something, I'll call you. That's all I can say. Good luck out there. I'm still alive, in case you're wondering. Should I put my KD ratio on my resume? Mrs. Amanda give me pill? She say it make me clean quicker. People watching me. Am I meant to find a job, or is a job meant to find me? I'm starting to understand why mom became a stripper and you robbed banks. Surely not spending money on a bunch of liberal arts degrees has got to count for something. Microwave, you use a lot of pots. 